Hello everybody, it's Redbeard Anubis, and welcome back to Resident Evil Code Veronica X. Okay. No, nope, don't save. Let's see, where am I at? Okay, so we already got the gold medallion. Perfect. And... I think we're missing something here. I want to select this. Did I already get that? I think I might have. Alright, email's been sent to Leon. I turned on the power. I think I already handled all that. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and remember. Yep. Okay. Wrong, wrong thing. Oh, it's this thing right here. That's it. So basically we... Oh, come on. Yep, come on. There we go. Alright, so that's good to go. To get it through the metal detector, we need to go find a special metal that will let us bypass this uh, stupid metal detector. And it's already prepared, so we're going to leave weapons and everything else. Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. Got it. Okay, we're going to put the ink ribbons there. So we don't need them. And all these zombies out there just itching to come after me. Now, anything I put in here, I have to take with me. Because it's not a... Uh, it's not an item box. They won't transfer. However, the combat knife, I leave because... I'll be honest, I really, I really don't use it. So we're gonna go ahead and get out here and get our uh, get our stuffs. Yep, here we go. And we got Okay, we got the fire extinguisher. Need that. Let's go ahead and reload real quick. Noise. Get in here. Grab the key. And... Alright, let's go back out here. I forget what side the padlock is on. It's on. It's the other side. Okay. Yeah, so we gotta go around. I have a feeling I know what's coming. It's been a while since I played this, but. Yep, I saw it. You bastards. Oh, good thing I got an ink ribbon. I mean, not an ink ribbon. Wow. A herb. Dogs. Gotta love Cerebrus dogs. And if we need it later, there is another a uh, other herb right here for us to get, so I'm not too worried about it. Down. I'll come deal with you later. I want to save my handgun ammo because I know I'm going to need it later. 
And this usually takes zombies down within a couple shots, so. Okay, he's moving out. Here. Use the fire extinguisher. First puzzle of the game, technically. Okay, let's get that. And get the heck out of here. take the fast way. Saves us some time, a little shorty cut. Please deposit any metallic items you have yep. in the security box. So I'm going to prepare for it. Let's uh, go ahead and do this. Check it. Check the case. Post the button. Basically, this we need a special alloy that can bypass metal detectors. Did not did not do that too well. Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. They're not gonna let me do it. I want them to break through that so I can kill them all. I think they break through on the way back. Yeah, they do. Well, that sucks. All right, go ahead and zap it up. complete. Yep. Thank you. All right, we need to get this to get... And here they come. You bastards. Get your guns, get your guns. Take the fire extinguisher with me. It's empty now, but I need to take it with me. But honestly, I'm just wasting ammo killing them, so let's move on. All right. All right, it's time to get the frick out of here. those zombies. We don't need to fight them. This game, I honestly, compared to a lot of other Resident Evils, probably is one of the most more challenging ones, in my opinion. Um, so, I mean, you really need to conserve ammo. 
useless fighting is not not a good thing. Never really is, but some games you can get away with it. Some games you have so much ammo by the end of it, you're just like, well, I think I'll just kill everything because I can. Uh huh. Yeah. I know. Just grab the handgun ammo. <laughs> Thank you. All right. All right. Another little trick here. Got to push the crate. I mean, we will be back through that area later in game, but as of right now, like I said, we don't need it. We don't need to fight them. All right, yep, put out the fire. And cross over nice and easy. And here we go. Up the stairs we go. can go through here and go to, a, I think it's a training center, but I don't want to do that yet. Got to go to the house anyway, so we might as well. Alright, up the stairs we go. Some puppers. Nice. Got one more. Yep. Bye bye, Cerebrus dogs. Gotta get the green sparkly thing. Okay, got the proof. And we'll go down these stairs for right now. And uh, we have to do it. Uh, we need the wheel first before we can do that. Okay, fair enough. I could have left the proof there, honestly. But it doesn't take up too much space, so we just need to get to an actual item box. And that's where the map for the palace is anyway, which is where we're going. Plus more handgun ammo. Can't go wrong with handgun ammo. Time to get to the save room. Okay, we got handgun ammo here. Go ahead and take that. I know we gotta do something with the computer. Enter employee ID to activate the unlocking device. Please enter your ID number. I don't know what that is. Nothing useful, nothing useful. Okay, so I gotta find the employee ID number. Remember where that's at. And if I'm not mistaken, I think this is the save room. Aha, yes, it is. Perfect. box real quick. Right, we're going to drop those for now. We're going to drop this for now. Bowgun bolts. And, uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and grab this. Okay, we need... Oh, what's down here? Ah, it's like the old days. 
merger. There we go. Got the ID card. Nice. Go ahead and grab this herb. We're going to go ahead and check this ID card. And there's our ID number. NTC0394. Noise. Actually, I think... Yeah, we're just going to take one herb. Alright, everybody, that's going to do it for this episode of Resident Evil Code Veronica X. We'll see you on the next Throwback Thursday. Make sure you take care of yourselves and have a wonderful, wonderful evening.